Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. What's up everyone? I'm Nico. I'm Chris and, and we, we are Spanish Foodies. Foodies. Welcome to this new restaurant review today. Today we are in Boston and in our search for the best restaurants to go, we are going to try a brand new restaurant here. This restaurant is Marseille, which is behind us. Mm -hmm. And this restaurant offers a variety of tapas and seafood inspired in the southern French cuisine. We have to find out if we can confidently recommend this place to your next uh, dining experience. Mm -hmm. Prepare your snacks, something to drink, your bouillabaisse or your favorite French dish. Mm -hmm. And let's come and eat with us. Bon, bon appétit! appétit. Well, we are all set here in the table. And um, the place is really beautiful. Uh, it's a very spacious place. Very bright uh, with a lot of natural light, which is great. It's elegant and cozy. The sound level is great for having a conversation. We came between brunch and mm -hmm. dinner menu, so... We're going to try some items from the brunch menu, so later we're going to try the diner menu. Uh, we're going to take a quick uh, review to the brunch menu and the drinks. They have a very interesting uh, wine selection. I'm seeing some Spanish cava, Spanish wine, so thank you so much for bringing Spanish uh, items or Spanish uh, drinks. Yeah, you can find some cocktails. You have beers on, on top, uh, pasta, pasta, pasta gas cocktail. cocktail. I don't know what is that. Local beers mm -hmm. and from I'm Mediterranean beers. They have a, a Spanish beer. Yeah. So good, so yeah, thank yeah. you. Yeah. They did brunch menu. They told us it's brand new. This is some cocky legs. Uh, There's seafood. Yeah, I saw some of the platters in the, uh, the dinner yeah. menu. Petit acid. We have some omelette options. Benedict, Benedict eggs. eggs. Shashuka. Yeah, French pastries and salads, sandwiches. I'm not gonna miss a, a French croissant. No. And the sucre. What is sucre? The, sugar. Uh, is the su is the sugar? It should be something like a dessert or something, yeah. something yeah. sweet, right? Mm -hmm. So, brunch menu ready. Okay, we're gonna take a look at the menu. Um, mm -hmm. Dinner menu. Uh, the first one is a seafood section, no? Mm -hmm. uh, Ustes, us, mm -hmm. Ustas, et coquillas. Mm -hmm. Yep. Then you can find some cold dishes. For example, the meds is a very typical combined platter that usually comes with hummus. In this case, the babaganus is made with eggplant instead of the chickpeas. Mm -hmm. We have the tartar, tartar of beef, mm -hmm. which is beef. beef okay. uh, the uo mimosa. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Some kind of eggs. Eggs. Wolf is eggs uh -huh. in French, no? Uh, and carpa carpaccio e tartare di ton. It's tuna. Um, <gasps> we also have tartinette, which mm -hmm. some, is like something to spread, probably on bread. Uh, salad, acid, cho chodos. Could be... Hot, hot appetizers. Hot, hot appetizers, yeah. topos. Kale frit is the, the quail, that is a wildfowl uh, bird. Gambas, which Gambas. is shrimps. Scargot and snakes, some and mortadella, mussels that is uh, mussels, witches like oysters. oysters. And then we have fromage. fromage. France is very famous for, for having great and excellent mm -hmm. cheese. Uh, Lot of resistance, like they are like um, Main entries. Yeah. Entries. Mm -hmm. We have steak, uh, brancino, which is the a, brancino. It's an Italian. Yeah, uh, white fish. White uh, fish, yeah. very typical in, Ita in Italy. Mm -hmm. The bouillabaisse, which is, I think, seem something that we need, we have to try here because it's a, yeah, one of the most typical uh, dishes in it's Marseille. It's a fish soup, uh, tomato base. But it comes with seafood, and fish, poulet roti, limone salute. Uh, a poulet is like a chicken, fried, uh, like a roast chicken. Okay, oh. and then some accompaniments and the parsley, parsley puree. Personally, mm -hmm. it was like a. It's like a white carrot. The yeah. Brussels mm -hmm. sprouts. Pommes frites, frites is like a. Uh, fries. Menu check. Yeah. Let's uh, see the food. Let's see the food. Well, this is one of the brunch menus uh, items. Mm -hmm. This is the Marseillaise. Uh, which omelette. Is the omelette mm -hmm. with ham, two types of cheese, mm -hmm. and 
some kind of um, butter, garlic, garlic. No, I think it's alioli. Some kind of natural alioli. Alioli is made of yeah, garlic. it's garlic a, mayonnaise. Uh, Mediterranean alioli. Mm. Did you know this kind of alioli is made with egg and olive oil and garlic? We're gonna cut it open and mm -hmm. see what's what's inside. One thing, as you said, is the, that the um, fries are um, frozen fries. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Let's see. They are very gen see. generous with the ham. Yeah. Yeah. Looks so great. See. Yeah. And I can see some onions inside too. Um, you can see here. Yeah, it's ham. plenty. It's plenty of ham. And, and the funny herbs on top. Yeah. Let's see how it tastes. Very juicy. Mm. It's not a strong mm. cheese flavor. And the onion is like a caramelized onion. From my point of view, yep. the king of this dish yep. is this mayonnaise or uh, alioli, alioli yeah. sauce. Mm. This garlic mayonnaise. When you mix it all together with, um, with the. It's egg, addictive. Uh, it's great. I definitely will repeat this one. Let's see the next one. Uh -huh. Next yeah. up in this French experience is the Mediterranean mm -hmm. mess. Mm -hmm. I think it's a must if you want to try some uh, Mediterranean flavors. Mm -hmm. yep. Um, here we can find three different spreads. Uh, the first one would be the muhammara. The base is uh, red pepper and some herbs. Um, the next one, the baba ganoush. Baba ganoush. Baba ganoush. Is this spread made of eggplants. Yep, yep. And, and then we can find the tapenade. Uh, this one is uh, like it's like a mayonnaise uh, or maybe like a um, cotton sauce with herbs. It's not the same, but just to make you uh, think about how the flavor can be. And, and to with try the, everything yep. out, uh, you have this pita. flat bread. It's pita a pita bread. Yes. bread. It's crunchy? Is it crunchy? Mm, yeah. It's not crunchy, it's very soft. Mm, I like it. Let's it's try it out. Yep. So, arriba, abajo, abajo al centro, centro y para I like it. It's not a spicy at all, but it has a strong red pepper flavor. It's very fresh oh. Oh. And, and, and very light. The texture? It's very soft. You yeah. don't feel like small mm -hmm. seeds or... Like it's a not, sauce. It's, it's, it's not it grainy. Is... You, don't, you don't feel any chunk of, of yeah. anything. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> Let's check out this one. Tapenade. They are very generous with the olive oil. Mm -hmm. You can see the black olives uh, like spread all over the sauce. Yep. The tepani <laughs> is usually done with olive oils, anchovies, mm -hmm. and some mix of herbs. Mm -hmm. Let's try. Mm. Very fresh. Like our chef, it's like a mm, white cocktail sauce. It like has a, a very strong sweet citrus. No. Lemon or lime. Which is give you mm. a hint of acidity, mm. but very yeah. light. Mm. It's more chunky. And let's try the last one. Mm. This one is a, this is spread made of eggplants, mm -hmm. no? And remember, it's made of eggplant instead of uh, chickpeas. So the base is a little bit different than an hummus, but it has to remind you to a uh, hummus. I love eggplant. And this is spread, is, it has a very clear mm. egg, mm -hmm. eggplant flavor and something that I really, really like. Something different mm -hmm. um, and I like it. Mm -hmm. We also had an assortment of uh, mm -hmm. bakery Pas selections. Pastries, yeah, and uh, we have the croissant, we have also the madeleine uh, with the orange and hibiscus and the palmero chocolate and almond. They come with know. Nutella and uh, butter. You know, croissant is something croissant. very French. Croissant. croissant. It's very crunchy outside, but it's very it's doughy and it's like a pillow in the inside. Very airy. Let's try it out. Mm. And this one uh, is very buttery and sometimes it's not so sweet, no? But no, it's great. It's not, it's not so sweet, it's not oily, of course. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna try with the butter. The butter gives an extra of saltiness. Yeah. Let's try this almond palmer. 
Palmer? Palmer, yep. Let's see. Mm. Has cinnamon. Mm. Mm. This one um, is not so spongy than the, than the yeah, it's more, pro, it's more huh? compact. Mm -hmm. if, if you love pastries, you're not gonna make a mistake if you choose any of them. And also we have this, like, it's like a biscuit, mm -hmm. the Madeleine, 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 Madeleine? Madeleine with Madeleine. orange and hibiscus. It has a, a strong orange smell. Mm. We like it. And, and the orange, I mean, the, the flavor is... The orange yeah. touch is, mm -hmm. is very good. Even though the three options are great, mm -hmm. if I were you, if I had to choose only one, mm -hmm. I would choose the croissant. Only the croissant yeah. because, yeah. It's With the very, Nutella. very yeah. fluffy, very spongy. Let's find what's next. Mm -hmm. Whoa, this is one of the first dishes uh, from the dinner menu. Uh, mm -hmm. This is the assortment of cheese yeah. with three, three different fromage. Mm. And they come with a, a, a feed, sweet, a sweet yeah. mm, accompaniment. Fig jam, jam oh, the walnuts, and honey. Walnuts and the honey. Right. And also it comes yep. with some uh, bread. Toast. And it's, and it's crunchy. It's not. It's toast. Yeah. It's toast. A pro tip is add a little bit of your favorite uh, jam. Jam option and then mm -hmm. some cheese. Let's try it out. Sin -sin. The combination of something sweet and the cheese is, is, is perfect. The fig jam is excellent. It's very strong, it's very sweet. And it's very... Uh, uh, and it's uh, overpowering a little bit the, the cheese flavor. It has a little, a little bit of this feet flavor, no? Uh -huh. Okay, That's let's try the second cheese, this pure cheese. It, the smell mm. really reminds me of this manchego uh -huh. Spanish yeah, cheese. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Well, let's try the I'm curious about, uh, about this. Try this out. Mm. I would say the strongest one is the goat, mm -hmm. then, then the, the manchego, um, yeah. and then this one. But it's also strong flavor. Yeah, it's very, a very, very different. different. Yep. Yes, mm -hmm. this fig jam is probably the best fig jam mm -hmm. I ever had. Mm. So far, it's excellent. Yeah, so thank yeah. You. This is another of the hot appetizers. Mm -hmm. This is the coil frit. It's a game bird that uh, is a small game bird that it comes with lamb kafka and the a honey glaze. Reduction sauce, or yeah. glaze. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, and also as a com yeah. accompaniment, we ordered this parsnip, 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 parsnip which is a white carrot, white tuber. Mm -hmm. And it comes with scrambles. Uh, I see some sweet onions. And chickpeas. Some chickpeas. Yeah, chickpeas. No, hazelnut. 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 You know chickpeas. Yeah, the quail is already fried. Mm. It has a hint of spiciness. Mm -hmm. This kind of game birds, mm, their meat is has a stronger flavor. It's stronger than chicken. It's more dry, but mm -hmm. it, the flavor is stronger, so you're gonna like it a lot. Mm. Mm. Glaze, so this reduction is not very sweet mm -hmm. and it's not overwhelming. Mm. I'm gonna try the parsnip. It's a flavor that, I mean, I cannot explain it because I, I think I never tried this, this the, before. The texture and, and it looks like... Like and, bread, like and, a smosh potato. Yeah. But the taste is something different. Butternut squash with carrot. It reminds you to the smash. A smash potato, yes. Mm -hmm. The bouillabaisse. Bouillabaisse. This fish soup, typical from southern. Friends. It usually comes fish, with, some seafood yeah. and like scallops, this jumbo trains. Mm -hmm. And the base is mussels, tomato base. Mussels, mm -hmm. Some Provence, typical Provencal uh, herbs. One thing that makes it different from other stalls or soup is that uh, you have to taste the saffron, fennel seeds, and the orange. Yeah. It's full of uh, fish, seafood. Yeah, yeah it, it uh, also comes with good. this. Piece of yeah, bread. baguette. I'm gonna try first this um, the, soup. Just the soup, yeah. Mm. 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 It has a very mm. strong seafood flavor. I feel the saffron. The scallops are Taste. very tender, very meaty. Mm. It's slightly salty. I love the flavor. I mm. love the flavor. The orange maybe gives some acidity to the soup, but the the saffron, yeah, you some feel. Muscles. Mm. Mmm, mm. mussels are very tasty, very strong flavor. Mm. Here we have a very big chunk of fish. I'm not sure mm. what kind of fish is this one. Definitely it's a white fish. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm gonna 
try the, the head of this. Maybe the, all the juices are in the soup right now, but... Yeah. Mm. Maybe you think that, that when, when the shrimp is bigger, the flavor is stronger, but no. Usually the, the smaller ones are the, the, most, the most flavorful ones. So it's difficult that a jumbo a shrimp, uh, it's so tasty, so flavorful. I'm gonna try the bread. Definitely, I would repeat this one. If I come here, you have to try this one. Mm -hmm. You can definitely share this kind of. It's it's big enough for sharing. Did you know that the Bujabes uh, has its origins in the ancient Greece when the when Mashi was founded? I'm ready for the dessert. We were looking at the dessert menu, and we finally decided to try the one creme of the most brulee. typical French yeah. dessert, which is the creme brulee. Mm -hmm. Is this um, custard? base with a caramelized sugar on mm. top. Oh, we can, we can this is a this is the creme brulee test. Oh. This dish is similar, I would yeah, say identical yeah. to a one that we have in Spain. Uh, crema catalana. Catalonian mm -hmm. cream or crema catalana. Mm -hmm. And as a compliment we have again the orange uh, madeleine. Ooh. Oh. 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 Oh, oh, look at the caramel, look at the caramel. So, oh, it has a surprise. Yes, it has like, like blueberries. Blueberries inside. No, it's not blueberry. I'm yeah. not sure. And I'm gonna try with a little bit of everything. It's a very creamy uh, vanilla Texture, flavor. Yeah. You, you can feel the, the yak, the yolk flavor. It's a very light and for this, um, amazing dinner here. And I, I think uh, it's a very good representation of the French mm -hmm, cuisine, mm -hmm, the southern French mm -hmm. cuisine. Um, and of the, some, some of the Mediterranean flavors too, so. I really like the caramelized, the caramelized yeah, cover. Yeah, yeah. It has this dark um, flavor. Toast. Not, not, yes, toast. No, not burnt, but mm -hmm, toast. Toast. Yeah, sugar, sugar flavor. flavor. Mm -hmm. Well, the check mm -hmm. is here. <laughs> The total check is 155. Uh, mm -hmm. We have to say that we are very, very thankful to the restaurant because yeah. they, they invite us uh, a couple of items, uh, the one of the drinks and, and the, the dessert. So we yeah. really appreciate that. Um, thank you so much. So the, the prices are the maize uh, 22, which was uh, one of the entries with yeah. the, the Mediterranean plate. Spreads. Yeah. The ham omelette, the um, cider, the two ciders, ten dollars each. The cheese selection, twenty-two. Mm -hmm. The quail fried, twenty, twenty-four. The parsley puree, thirteen dollars. The bouillabaisse, yep. thirty, thirty-eight. And the creme brulee, twelve dollars. Thank you for watching us till the end of this video. Give us a thumbs up if you like this kind of content. And don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget that we are just starting this adventure of Spanish foodies, so we really appreciate your support. Comment below and, and see, see you in the, the next, next one. one. This restaurant by the chef Robert Mark. Um, as this is a brand new restaurant. Brand new, <laughs> brand. <laughs> Prepare a bula vez or a, a your <laughs> Let's Let's come come with us. <laughs> Prepare your snack or your bulabes or your favorite. Bulabes. <laughs> Come and eat with us. Buen appetit. Se me había Buen appetit. No, let's come and eat with us. Prepare your snack or your bulabes or your favorite. Vale, to the. Buen appetit. I Let's will see. repeat this one. <laughs> Do you think it's manchego cheese? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so famous. Take a closer look of this. Mm. <laughs> well, let's check. <laughs> well, let's check. <laughs> Give us a thumbs up. <laughs>